Okay, looks like we have an ice cream cone and they want us to figure out the volume of the ice cream cone. So basically we have two shapes, don't we? This is a half of a sphere. It's half of a ball, half a sphere. And this part down here is a cone. So the volume then, the total volume is gonna equal the half a sphere plus the cone. So uh, let's go grab those uh, formulas. So here it is from the exam three notes. So here's, here's for the volume for an entire sphere. That's for a whole ball, a whole sphere. Four thirds pi r cubed, known as third power. So bring that back. Okay, we have a half a sphere. So we're gonna have a half times four thirds pi r cubed. And then cone, cone coming on down here. There's our cone volume, one third pi r squared h. Volume of the cone. So. Pi r squared h, okay. So we got our formulas in place. Let's do this. This is going to be a half times four thirds times use the pi button. And now the r, what is the r? Well, the radius, you know radius. It's always um, from the middle, halfway to the edge, you know, halfway across circle from the middle to the edge. So the radius is three, isn't it? We good there. So from the middle to the edge. So from the middle to the edge, halfway across the circle, the radius is three. Six, six is all the way across. And radius is always halfway across the circle. So that's three, okay. And um, again, here's the radius, three. And what's the height? That's that's uh, seven, isn't it? You can, you can see the height right there. The height of the cone is seven. So there it is. Just hit the buttons on your calculator now. So I, I'm just going to, what I do is I just literally, I mean, you could do cross canceling and fancy stuff if you want to, or you can just let the calculator do all the work. Just one divided by two times four divided by three times the pi button, you know? The calculator will do all this for you. You don't have to do fancy stuff. Times three, times three, times three. Like that, just let the calculator do it. Or you could, you could cross cancel if you wanna do that yourself. Um, I'm getting 56.5 five, four, eight, six, six, plus, and then this, same kind of thing, one divided by three times the pi button, times three, times three, times seven, right? And so we'll get there, pi, okay. I'm getting, um, 65.97344, add that to the other answer. <clears throat> and I'm getting total volume for the whole ice cream cone, 122.522. Um, there it is. So there's, it. they didn't say how many decimals, so I'll just give them three. I'm sure that's 20. Usually they just want two if they don't say anything. So there it is. There's the total volume. So we just used, we just said it's half a sphere. So we did half the sphere formula plus the cone formula. And then just plugged in. The radius was only three because that's halfway across the circle and the height is seven. There we go.